Hey, what's happening, guys? What you're seeing there is the tippy top of my 33 foot vertical end fed wire antenna that I've mounted out here in the backyard. There's a 9 to 1 auto transformer there at the bottom. And the wire goes way up there. So, let's head into the old computer and show you what's up. Hey, what's up? Let's have a look here. So what you're seeing here in front of you is my high frequency transceiver. This is the X108G and you can see it is in the 40 meter band here. 7.03860 and what I'm doing is I'm using a software program that's called Whisper. Whisper was created by a Nobel Prize winning physicist named Joe Taylor from Princeton University and what it does is it allows digital signals to be sent over the air and decoded by the computer and it's just some amazing stuff signals so low they, they can't even be heard with the ear can easily be found with the software so the next thing we're going to do here pardon me bumping things we're going to come down here and take a look at the computer all right, what we're looking at here is the Whisper software itself. And this is the uh, waterfall display, which is really showing me a bunch of crap. And then over here, we have the decode window. And Whisper works on an incredibly slow transmit it takes two minutes to transmit a whisper packet and i don't know how well you guys can see this where's my mouse at there where there's the mouse okay so down here we are about 45 seconds into a two minute transfer i'm going to bring up the waterfall display again now you can see over here these are the frequencies where we should be picking up some whisper transmissions. So when we get to the end of this here, of our two minutes, we should get an automatic decode here. And we'll then go in there and find out where these stations are from. And that'll give me an idea of just how well my antenna is working. So there's about 30 seconds left. I'll come back when it's done. All right, we're just about to the end. And we can, as you, if you look up here, you can see we've picked up two signals. We have their call sign right here. The first one is Kilo Zero Delta Sierra Papa. And he is 841 miles away. The second one is Whiskey Victor 5 Lima and he is 468 miles away. Now what we can do is we can bring up a web browser and we're going to go into the Maidenhead Grid Square locator and if you look up here you can see grid EN10. So if I come up here and I type in EN10, we can find that this guy is from somewhere in the Lincoln, Nebraska area. Now that's pretty cool. The second one is EM74. Oops. 
So I type in EM74. And where is this guy from? The Chattanooga, Tennessee area. How about looks like about halfway between Chattanooga and Atlanta. Let's see if we're going to pick up any more signals here. Go back and have a look at the waterfall. Looks like there's some stuff coming in. And we should be ready to decode here in about seven seconds. Decoding now. Boom. We got some more. A grid EM90GG. So let me put that up here. EM90GG. And where are you from, my friend? Look at that. We're down there around the Jacksonville, Florida area. So we are we are picking up fantastic stuff. Next one, EL98. So, EL98. From the Orlando, Florida area. We'll take a look at one more. EN44. EN44. And that looks like Wisconsin in the Eau Claire, Wisconsin area. So, I mean, this is, this is pretty impressive in my book. Just look at all of these digital signals out there. And we're picking them up. And this software is translating them, telling us uh, the signal strength, the frequency they received on any drift, their call letters, their grid square, and how many miles away. So that 33-foot piece of wire sticking straight up out of my backyard is picking up stations from as far away as Florida, Wisconsin, Tennessee. That's not bad. I'm kind of impressed. Because believe me, antennas are not my thing. So I hope you guys enjoyed this little introduction to Whisper, the WSPR, the Weak Signal Propagation Reporter. You can go to whisper.net. I'll put a link down below if you're interested in learning more about this. Because you're only seeing one part of it here. There's a whole other part on their website. And uh, maybe we'll look at that later if there's more interest. If there is, let me know down below. Otherwise, give the old guy a thumbs up. Feel free to comment, share. Don't forget to subscribe. A big thank you to every one of you for watching and clicking, and commenting, and a big thanks to all the patrons. That's it. I'm out. Peace.